pleased to announce that this semester's organic produce fundraiser was a huge success with every student buying at least one tomato. Oh. And now I have a very special announcement. Finnegan High School will be visited by none other than Mr. Bruce Willis. Oh. Oh. I loved him as a renegade cop, single-handedly ridding a skyscraper of terrorists. I'm afraid I don't mean the actor, Bruce Willis. My Mr. Willis is my mentor. He was principal of the principal school I attended before I became principal of this school. Someday, I hope to be janitor at janitor school. Very cushy job. As part of curriculum, student must clean school. Anyway. Since Bruce Willis will be visiting, I'd like us all to honor him with a rendition of our school song. I didn't know we had a school song. There's lots you don't know, Miss Young, and I have your grades to prove it. <laughs> I found this decades-old song in the Finnegan High Archives. Uh, by the way, I'd stay out of the Finnegan High Archives. There are spiders. <laughs> At Finn again, our school's one room, just as it should be. Boys get books, girls get a broom, just as it should be. Our bloomers are wool, our pencils are lead. Boys use a slide rule, girls needle and thread for donning. You'll be judged on your Latin fluency just as it should be. Polio's no excuse for truancy just as it should be. Cod liver oil makes a healthy snack. Out comes the strap if you talk back for beating. <laughs> Finn again, oh Finn again, our handbell rings for thee. Finn again, oh Finn again, just as it should be. Finn again, oh Finn again, just as it should be. As we pass around the colony, you'll see that ants are one of the most fascinating members of the arthropod phylum. Ants? I thought these were poppy seeds. <laughs> ants are inspiring because they work as a team, creating a result greater than the sum of its parts. For example, they are able to lift up to 50 times their own weight. Big deal. Who can't lift 50 ants? <laughs> Mr. Young, as you may have noticed at the assembly, our school song received a mixed response. <laughs> Who threw that? The ants did. The ants? Not all of them. That group over there. Anyway, I tweaked the song, removing any parts that could be deemed offensive. Let me sing it for you. Finn again. <laughs> Thoughts? Not bad. A bit one note. <laughs> what if the students wrote a new song? There are a lot of creative minds in this school. Behold, fellow ants. I am your king. Go forth and bring me more tomatoes. <laughs> because they're rich in the antioxidant lycopene. <laughs> That's a great idea. The students will engage in cutthroat competition to write the best song, clawing all over each other to have their anthem chosen. 
while a Darwinian survival of the fittest philosophy may work in the animal kingdom, it breaks down when applied to human behavior, which is also colored by shared social values and ethics. I'm not sure I understand. Are you saying I want clawing or I don't? You don't. Then no, you're way off. <laughs> in fact, since it was your idea, I'm gonna make you a judge. Along with uh, Mrs. Byrne, Dang, and myself. I don't want to be a judge. Which is why you'll be such a good judge. It doesn't make any sense. Well, that is geometry, but we teach it anyway. <laughs> no one's going to compete to write a new song. The winner gets exclusive access to the private bathroom on the second floor. Yeah! <laughs> wait, wait. wait, first, in theater. To the recording studio, my loyal subjects. <laughs> New shirt? I like your shoes. Just give me the bathroom. <laughs> You're not going to influence my decision. You really think my hair looks nice? <laughs> oh, come on. I need that bathroom. It's my dream. <gasps> Go free! You have got some fabulous hair. <laughs> Buckle up. Because we're going to town. Going to be so crazy. That's what you'd use the bathroom for? When Adam votes for me, <laughs> I plan to share it with the entire school. Echo, I'd really like to use your private bathroom. Sure thing, Jiggle Knees. That'll be $5. But I really have to go. Oh, well, in that case, 10 <laughs> No, wait. 20. Fine. But when I win the bathroom, it'll be you paying me. Not you. But I own the place. Sorry. Not on list. <laughs> your dream is to be kept out of your own club? Hey, if I owned a place that would let the likes of me in, it wouldn't be much of a fantasy, would it? <laughs> All I've heard is me, me, me. This should be about me. <laughs> Give me the bathroom. You'll be making life easier for a lot of people. Look into my dream cloud. <laughs> Number forty two. <laughs> one vivid dream cloud. <laughs> okay, everyone. Let me make this very clear. The judges cannot be influenced. Nice hair. New dentures. I like your orthopedic shoes. Just give me the bathroom. <laughs> All day it was new shoes, nice shirt. All just to influence my vote. You mean that flattery wasn't sincere? So I'm not the world's greatest principal? <laughs> this mug is a lot. All rise for the honorable Judge Byrne. Honorable? <laughs> Clearly, she's forgotten about last year's staff party. No, no one needs to see that dream cloud. I thought Dang was also judging. He is! Ah! First up, Jordan Shravinsky. Good day. Please join me in celebrating Finnegan High through the soothing sounds of my school song. Your face. <laughs> Shh. 
sha la 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 uh -huh. I never want to hurt you, want to give you what you need. If I don't win this contest, one of you will bleed. I never want to hurt you, I hope you can take a punch. If you don't choose my song, I'll eat one of you for lunch. Your face, I'm gonna punch your face. Smile or scowl, whimper or howl, it doesn't matter to me. Vote for me or I'm going to punch your face. <laughs> Your face. What an interesting song about Dang. I like the melody <laughs> and that he didn't actually punch my face. Uh, why punch face? Pancreas more painful. <laughs> Though harder to run. Guilty. Next up, Derby. Derby, what about your song? Oh, so that's what the backup singers meant by, you don't have a song. Oh. Next up, Ivy Young. I present to you, the Finnegan Blues. Ever since I was a young girl, about the age of 14, I've been going to Finnegan, the worst high school that's ever been. It's run by a principal who ain't too bright. The only time he shines is when his head reflects the light. The teachers belong in a cradle, and some in a tomb. The janitor has a black belt, but can barely use a broom. I got the blues, the Finnegan High School. If I weren't in this district, another school I'd surely choose. Oh, yeah, I got the Finnegan Blues. She so perfectly captured the spirit of this place. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's my suit. I was saving that to wear to Tater's wedding. <laughs> <laughs> that school songs are always so violent. Fight on! Fight, fight, fight! Your face. I want to punch your face. <laughs> so, by tuning in to Eco Station Zulu in the untouched rainforests of the Haida Gwaii Archipelago, we can have a school song orchestrated by nature's peaceful serenity. Oh, that is nice. <laughs> On second thought, fight Finnegan, fight! <laughs> These songs are all awful. <laughs> They're not awful. They stink like Reef Monkey dropping. <laughs> Just because you wear a fancy hat doesn't mean your poop don't smell. It appears the jury is deadlocked. Well, I see like most things around this school, I'll have to do this myself. There is a perfect school I know. I like to go there in my dreams. Walking the grounds from morn till night. Don't have to break up a single fight. There is a perfect school I know. It is a quiet, peaceful place. Nobody running in the hall. 
smashed tomatoes on the walls. Where is a perfect school I know? Nary a conflict nor a prank. It's just like summer all year round. No students or teachers to be found. Where did you go? We heard like two lines of your song. Now that I know judges can enter, let me take this off. What's the matter? You act like you weren't at last year's staff party. <laughs> Forget Cleopatra's asp. Catherine the Great is not. Annie Oakley's shooting plants don't of all. She ain't so hot. We don't need Agatha Christie to solve this mystery. Cause all through history, Finnegan's always had this. <laughs> Marie Antoinette, don't take the cake. Jane Austen's an open book. Amelia Earhart is not so fly, do you, child? She just don't cook. So forget me, West, and all the rest. They don't pass the test. Cause Finnegan's always had this. That was mildly disturbing. Yeah, that was not at all tantalizing. <laughs> no one here know what good school songs should sound like. We had a great one back at Chuan Hun Tao Elementary. Isn't it in Vietnamese? He was. But I run lyrics to computer translating program. <laughs> Same one toy factory used for assembly instruction. Okay, why don't you take the stage? Already have. <laughs> <laughs> With the heart which thinks gratefully, us your praise song. The school of joy which is valuable does, and the duty in the land where the reef monkey reef in brings. <laughs> Chuan Hung Da, which does and us strife while navigates darksome cave where lesser false vampire bat down upside hang. <laughs> Joyful there is our heart, and us to our boy is full pride. Come on! <laughs> Songs still move me. Well, I guess it's time to reveal our votes. Dang, who did you vote for? <laughs> Me next! You voted for yourself. I don't recall seeing anyone else do a song. <laughs> you two are pathetic. How low do you have to stoop to vote for yourself? Who did you vote for? It doesn't make what you did any less pathetic. All right, all right. Since Mr. Young is the only one who can be impartial, I guess we'll go with whomever he voted for. Ooh, Ivy, fashion alert. You wore that yesterday. Adam said to show up ready to perform. He told me I won the contest. He told you you won the contest? But he told me I won the contest. Me too. Me too. Me too. Although, looking back, it does seem weird considering I didn't write a song. <laughs> Mr. Young, I demand you tell me exactly what's going on here. Yeah, who's the real winner? Not one of you won the contest. Oh. Oh. Because all of you have. Wait. Oh, oh, so confusing. <laughs> here comes Bruce Willis. Ah, <laughs> oh, he hasn't changed a bit. <laughs> we have to sing something. Just trust me on this one. There 
There's a perfect school I know. I like to go there in my dreams. I've been going to Finnegan, the best high school that's ever been. There is a perfect school I know. It is a quiet, peaceful place. It doesn't matter to me. I'm going to punch your face. <laughs> And the duty in the ran with the reef monkey ribs in breeze. Cause all through history, Finnegan's always had this. <laughs> Finnegan, oh Finnegan, a school bell rings for me. Finnegan, oh Finnegan, just as it should be. Finnegan, oh Finnegan. Just as it should be! Well, sir, what did you think? Huh? What? Talk louder, I'm deaf in one ear. What did you think, sir? And the other. He's deaf? Huh. All those years of principal school, I thought he was teaching us that a good principal ignores his students. <laughs> Since we were all part of this song, who gets the private bathroom? That's not important, Echo. Teamwork, that's what matters. <laughs> Woohoo, we're the best. You work wrong. You awarded it to yourself, didn't you? Well, I did put the pieces together. Who's gonna put your pieces together? <laughs> okay, relax. <laughs> we can figure this out if we work together as a team. <laughs> Careful! You're standing on my foot. Burn, you're hogging the toilet. You want it so bad, Baldy? Come and get it! <laughs> Come on, let me in. I won too. Sorry. Not on list.